YouTube channel my name's Danny for those of you that don't know me today is the 29th of June it's Thursday and I am three days out I can hardly actually believe it to be honest three days three days oh I'm in such a good mood this morning I have been all week like this week is just disappearing um, but I took my check-in photos this morning and I actually had a little bit of a cry like of just happiness and pride and um, honestly I couldn't be happier with what I've achieved with how I look, with how everything's gone like oh, honestly I'll, I'll insert I think I, I did film my, my, me doing my check-in but I'll insert some of my shots here see if I can do a funky little edit um but honestly like looking at that that that's me and I've achieved this goal that I set myself out a couple of years ago and I'm about to get on stage and showcase years of hard work it's just fucking nuts and I'm so so happy so yeah, I fucking won to me on Sunday, like whether I come first or last. Oh, I'm just so, so happy with what I've achieved, like, oh, but anyway, so we're three days out and carbs start today. I have had, I've been very lucky, I've not gone down to zero carb at any point, but carbs have been low at 65 grams a day. So we're going up to 250 today, which is so exciting. So I'm going to take you obviously through everything I'm eating. Steps are at 5,000. We've got an extra two litres of water. So I'm going to be drinking seven litres of water today, which is for me joyful because drinking five was hard because I was drinking so much. Um, 
Um, what else is different? An increase in vitamin C. And yeah, just chilling. So it's eight o'clock now. Um, I had a client six till seven and now I've not got to go back out today. So I've got some computer bits to do. Um, I'm basically just chilling. So I'm gonna take you through packing my show day case with me because I'm just gonna get all that done today because I think I've got everything now. So and it allows me then a few days in case it is anything I've missed. So I'm gonna do that take you through all my food i've done some posing practice i've been through my routine a few times had a stretch um so yeah i'm feeling really 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 good and really positive about yeah the next few days i've loved this process and i'm loving peak week um it's flying like i thought this week was going to drag with me doing less and stuff but honestly like it is just disappearing so so fast so yeah i'm just gonna lap up every moment just nipped and got the one thing that i was missing from the high day today full size bagel for meal one so yeah i'm gonna go in the house now um and make meal one and of course i'll show you so yeah catch you in a bit we are three days out Woo! Just thought I'd quickly show you what my little uh, gym fit was today because really liked it. All black, all Honor Active, and then my New Balance. And honestly, living for Honor Active at the minute. It's like so dreamy and buttery and comfortable. So yeah, all little black and white number. Just making meal one, so. The difference to this meal, so it's still three bacon medallions, one egg with my mushroom, onion and spinach, but I get a big bagel. Oh, honest to God, I just cut it and the smell. Oh, I'm so excited to eat this meal. So yeah, I'll show you when it's done. Mm, I'm gonna spray these with a little bit of this. I've also been debating, do I have it open or do I have it as a sandwich? But I'm going with open with the toppings on top, so yes. Here we have it. Oh, I'm so excited to eat this. Mmm. Sat working in bed with my feet or watching some old YouTube. I get used to this chilled life. No, I'm joking. I've got work to do which is keeping me occupied and then I'm going to film me packing my bags and stuff so yeah it's currently half ten and I'm going to push it out another hour until I eat I think so yeah just chilling nearly drank one of these need to hurry it up so I've got into the habit of slowing it down to drink less so now I've got a drink this is 1.5 litres Like three and a half bottles, I think. Ugh, prep brain. Prep brain, I've been on my computer too long. So yeah, I'll catch you in a bit. Hello, it's time for my next meal. So this meal, I got given a choice. So it was 30 gram of protein from whey and then 65 oats or cereal and berries. Now berries I'm saving and I'm gonna put them in my yogurt. Um, I've put the whey in the freezer though, so that I can try this. So I'm gonna attempt now to make some ice cream. And then she said, obviously 65 oats or cereal, so I'm gonna have a bowl of cereal which I'm not buzzing about. Mixed in here then, we've got my 30 grams of protein from whey. I've gone with the chocolate pistachio. Just with water, I blended it, and then I froze it. So, I'm gonna attempt to use my Ninja Creamy. <laughs> Right, 65 gram of cereal, we've got Cocoa Pops Chocos and then the big rocks. I've just mixed them together. So 
that's that and then this is done God, no way. so this is what it looks like see that actually look for the ice cream obviously mate spoon I'm going to film this literally it is like ice cream let's do a taste test that is unbelievable wow well day. it's just might have been made a hundred times better that is so good i'm gonna go and eat my ice cream i'm not sure whether it's gone yeah it is all the way down it's just the side looks frozen so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna eat my ice cream and eat my cereal. So this is meal two of my high day and I am so fucking pussing about it. <laughs> oh, my day has been made by an inch creamy. Need to buy one, if you haven't got one, buy one. Thank you. So I've leveled it up even more. I've just put some of my cereal in it <laughs> and it adds crunchy bits. <laughs> Oh, I'm just loving life right now. Good afternoon, guys. So obviously the last time you see me, I was eating meal two. Um, ice cream was so, so, so good. I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed every single little last mouthful. I also um, put some of my cereal in it. So I had like crunchy bits in it, which was amazing. So yeah, I've eaten that. Um, and now I thought I'd take you through everything I've brought for show and my show day bag because some people might be interested and it means I can sort it out as well it's part of what I wanted to get done today so I'm going to be taking my calorie on suitcase just my little one um, a lot of people recommend this that have competed before just so that you've not got to carry a strap on your shoulder or carry bags because obviously you want to be as rested as possible on show day you don't want a big strap digging in your shoulder and stuff when you've got your tan on so this is just going to be so much easier for me to get about on show day then i've also got a new meal prep bag so i've had this off amazon and what i can do is i can just pop that on top of the suitcase um a couple of bits i've got before i go into what will be coming with me is I've got a single black bed sheet. Um, all my bed sheets are all white, like every single set. So, and obviously I don't want to get um, tan all over a white sheet. So I'm just gonna sleep in this with the black pillowcase on and I'm gonna lay just a flat sheet underneath me as well, just to make sure I don't get any, um, tan anywhere so they're obviously for the night and then i'll wash these and use them so obviously i'm competing three times i'm staying at home for my first two just because the shows aren't that far from me so um it's just easier and i'd rather be in the comfort of my own home and then the last show i'm staying in an airbnb so they will be coming with me so i don't get a fine for ruining bed sheets so those then in the case so i'll do a little overlay here so I have to move the camera of how it looks but we have start on this side so on this side we've got my resistance bands for pumping up on the day now these ones are quite good I've had these for a long time but they've got little clips so you can attach handles so I can like really help myself get a pump on backstage I'm also going to be bringing um some dumbbells from sibling just some little uh three kilo dumbbells so that's good obviously heels need to be in there they're not going to stay in here but i just wanted to make sure everything fit nicely um and then for show day and tan i've just brought some black flip-flops from primark because obviously they're just going to get trash off you just bin them when i'm done competing because they're going to be absolutely covered in tan so i've got those i've also to put on for tan i've just had an oversized black t-shirt dress just because it's really light really airy um nothing digging in easy so i'm gonna wear that to go for my tan on saturday 
on Sunday morning. I'm also, I've got some oversized trackies and a jacket, which I'm gonna wear on show day to go around until I need to get dressed and then I'll put my robe and stuff on. So I've also got black shower cap. Now obviously being blonde, I don't want any tan in my hair. So I'm gonna put that on for both my tan and my top coat just to make sure that I don't get orange hair, effectively. So we've got that. Then we've also, this might be a little bit extra, but I've just brought one of these mirrors because if I need to touch up my makeup, like my makeup bag's not in here, but that will be coming with me as well. If I need to do any touch-ups of my makeup or my hair or what, whatever, or have a quick look over, like this mirror is just gonna be so much easier than a little handheld one. So I just brought that from B&M. It was like four pounds. And then I've got a black towel because you have to take a black towel with you for tan. So that's in that side. In this side, we have obviously my bikini, which is coming in the box just to make sure obviously it doesn't get damaged or anything. And then I've also got my show day robe, which I've had from Black Eye. So I'll wear this obviously once my bikini is on. It's all sparkly, which is really nice. So yeah, I've got that to be wandering around in until I am required to go on stage. And then I've brought these packing parcels. Now these have come in massive handy. So in this one, we've got my jewelry. So bracelet, earrings, ring, etc. So that's all in there. In this little one, I've got, so in here we've got my AirPods so that when I'm backstage I can just find a corner and just switch off for a little bit before I go on stage if I want to. I've got some camera battery chargers, so my camera will be, will be with me with my tripod, some little extra batteries just in case. I've got my portable phone charger, which is full, and obviously then I'll pop my phone charger and stuff in. Um, just because obviously I don't want my phone to go, I want to be able to take pictures, I want to be able to enjoy the day. Obviously I need to be in touch with Soph throughout the day. She's going to be there, but just in case I'm not safe help like. so. And then this also came in the packing parcels, which is really useful. And in here I've just got toothbrush, some toothpaste and some Tampax. Now obviously I have lost my period, but being a female it's better to be safe than sorry. So they are emergency. And then obviously because I'm going to be eating on and off and stuff, I'm going to go and brush my teeth after the last thing I eat before I go on stage. And then in this big bag here, we have everything else. So I've got, I mean this needs, oh, my fans come on. So, first thing is this fan. Now on the list I've seen it and I thought, you know what, I am gonna get one because Obviously the tan, and if it is really hot backstage, I don't want my tan to start running or my makeup or to get sweaty up a lip. So I've just brought a little electric fan <laughs> from Amazon. It's really good actually. So I've got that. I've also got my hair removal cream. This is actually now gonna stay out because tomorrow I need to remove all the hair on my body, minus the hair on my head, so. Yeah, that's for tomorrow so that can stay out. I've also brought a little sewing kit just in case, which touch wood it doesn't, um, anything happens to my bikini. And also likewise some Gorilla Glue, just in case I need it. I've got some tissues, I've got some Femme Fresh wipes, some uh, simple makeup wipes, might need them, might not. Again, I've just brought everything, some mouthwash, um, so nail polish remover pads. Now these, I'm just gonna go over the tops of my nails. The acetone free, so I'm just gonna go over the tops of my nails after my tan, just so that like the white on my tips doesn't go orange or anything. And then I've brought this. Now, I should probably practice with this so that I'm not trying to use it once I've got my tan and making a mess. But this is a shiwi. Yeah, I know. Interesting. Very interesting contraption, but don't want to ruin my tan, so. And I also don't want to be going to the tan people every five minutes backstage asking them to sort my tan out because I've been to the toilet and made a mess. So, I'm gonna practice with that. Not that you need to know that, but, yeah. Tweezers, because on every show day list it says tweezers, so, tweezers. Also, my bikini bum tape, so this is to help secure my bikini on me my bikini is secure but this tape obviously 
where it is is just gonna ensure that when I'm moving about on stage that like, I'm not gonna flash anyone. So I mean touch wood that doesn't happen. And then I've also got some painkillers just in case I need them and I've got in here um my lipstick that I'm gonna be wearing on the day, some lip oil and some Vaseline because I can't stand dry lips. So that is everything I've got in here so far. Like I said, obviously I'm gonna be having I'll have my phone, I'll have my camera, I'll have my charger, I'll also have money. Um and yeah, and then obviously all of my food. So quite a bit really that goes in to come with you on show day. But like I said, I've probably gone over the top. I probably won't even use half of it. I'd rather have it and know it's there and not have it and be like, oh, I wish I had that because I don't want anything to stress me out on show day. So yeah. So in terms of food, so Safe has told me I've got to bring my Vasky Max to help me get pump on backstage. Just before I pump up, I'll obviously have some of this. So I also need a shaker. I also need pink salt. And then all I've got in here at the minute is my rice cakes and some chocolate squares bars. Now, when Safe said to get squares bars for pumping up, I was so excited because I love a squares bar. And I haven't had one since I started prep. So for 21 weeks, I haven't had a squares bar. So I was like, yes. Um, I've also got to have some cooked chicken, which will obviously go in here. Um, my dark chocolate's in the fridge. Peanut butter. Um, obviously pink salt. I'll bring my scales too to weigh anything out. Bananas, which I need to get. I'll get them probably on Saturday, so they're fresher. And then I'm also going to put in here for after my granola protein bars. Um, Pepsi Max and Monster. So yeah, that is a print coming show of me. Oh, I've just woken up from honestly the most unreal nap. Literally like snuggled here. Stop. Honestly, 45 minutes of pure heaven. But it's now um, nearly 2 o'clock. So I should probably go and eat my next meal. Here we go then. This meal is my usual. 120 chicken, 150 potato, broccoli, salad, 10 gram of peronese, and then I've got 20 gram of carb from fruit. So I've got a mix of strawberries and raspberries. Look at that be big bowl of fruit. Mmm. Gorgeous. Actually, just being sat editing this video for the past like half an hour just so that I can get it up first thing tomorrow I think so when I finish it tonight I can finish it off and get it up tomorrow for you guys so yes because I'm going to film it'll be every day now I want to film and get every day up before Sunday and then obviously probably it'll be Monday or Tuesday show day will be up so yes it's four o'clock, so I'm gonna go and make my yogurt, which goes with my last meal. But I want that with my berries, and then I'm gonna have another chicken salad in a bit in about an hour. And then my bagel, and then I've got oats tonight. Mmm. So yeah, bye bye. So 250 grams of Greek 0% yogurt, and then 75 grams of frozen blueberries. And what I do is I microwave them for a minute, so they defrost and go juicy, and then I mix it in. So you've basically got blueberry yogurt. It's done. First part of my next meal, 120 gram of chicken with just some lettuce, cucumber and peronies. And then second part will be coming shortly. And a bagel thing with 20 gram of jam. We all know one of my favourite things. Beautiful. Final meal of the day. So excited about this. We've got 65 gram of oats banana and 20 grams of nut butter oh this combo is just dreamy honest to god so happy mm -hmm. 